Hey guys, and welcome back to The Sims 4 Rotational Play. We are here with, um, the world, I guess, because we're not really in a, in a household. Um, so what I want to do today is I want to calculate how many households I have, and I want to start including, um, what are they called? Random scenarios I guess to specific amount of households I think I'm gonna do the same as I'm gonna do for my personal um, Sims 2 game which is 25% which it ended up being I don't know there's like 60 households it was like 15 households it wasn't like a lot so that's what we're gonna do and I want to see if I like it and if I don't then obviously I can just take it out because that's all good where's my phone um, so yeah so that's something I'm going to be doing tonight and then I'm probably just going to be doing the random the random thingies if they're on any of the households that we've already played obviously. If we if we haven't already played the household then we'll do it when we get to the household. So it's just going to be up until the households of what we've already played. So yeah. So I am going to write down how many households we have and I'm just going to count through here because it's going to be easier than trying to like go through each and every world. So we have um, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. I also am going to try and make sure that we actually have these households. So that's 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27. 28, 29, 30, 31, 33, 33, 34, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, 40, 41, 42, 43, 44, 45, 46, 47, 48, 49, 50, 51, 52, 53, so 53, 56, 58. And there's no households in here, right? These guys, I really want to add him to the ha the world. So 58 is what I got to remember. 58. Um, I want to add these two households to the world. Um, yeah, I think that's it. Just 58. Okay, so... Let me write that number down because I'm going to forget it if I don't write it down somewhere. Alright. So it's 58 households. And let me calculate real quick what 25% of that is. Oh, wow. Wow. So it's about 14 households, so it equals about the same as my, um, my, like, Sims 2 personal thingy. So now I'm going to go online and I'm going to look up a, um, like a random number generator. But I want one where I can have it. Yeah, this is what I want. Okay, so lower is one. The upper is 58. And we want to generate 14 numbers. No duplications. And we want them ascending so that they're easy to type out the numbers or remember the numbers. Okay. So the lower, the upper, there we go. Okay, so our numbers are 9, 12, 21, 22, 23, wow, 26, 27, 28, 38, 30, er, 38 41, uh, 47, 52, 
56 and the last one is 58. Okay, so now that I've got all that done, that's only for this round as well, because obviously when we do like another round, then I would generate a whole nother amount. And depending on how many households we have then would be how many I would do, like I would still do just like 25% of that. So we're looking for number nine. I don't know if we've played nine households yet. So this is one, two, three, four. Um, then it was five, six, seven, eight, nine. The land grabs. The land grabs will be the first household that I'm gonna do a scenario with. So I'm gonna load into their household real quick. Hope it's not like a really horrible one. And then I have a random generator for scenarios. Um, it says that it's based off of The Sims 2 and The Sims 3, but you could try it for The Sims 4. So we're gonna try it. And if I don't like it, I guess I'll always have to like, go in and probably like just add or create my own or something. Okay. Every single time I come into a house, this has to happen. Why? Um. Okay. So we're going to pause. What is this? <laughs> oh, that's right. I, for I forgot about that. I was like, wow. Okay. Um. All right. So let me generate a random event or a random scenario. Um, it just says generator gives you a specific scenario in your sim you are currently controlling. You need to pick one of the random choices and make this scenario happen in the game. There's a hundred plus scenarios. Uh, you can earn money or lose money. The number of your sims X's will probably double. Unexpected accidents are likely to occur and this generator is going to decide who's going to die. Uh, plastic surgery is possible. You need to change your sim's appearance accordingly. This generator will tell you if your sim is sterile or not. It'll give you a lot of babies. It'll also like adoption and also teen adoption. Um, the generator can change your sim's traits and sexuality. The generator can change your or choose your sim's career major and aspiration, which is kind of cool. Certain scenarios will bring you a pre-made choice that you need to accept, and then certain scenarios will force you to learn, lose, or earn something depends on the random choices you have. So we'll see what we get. Um, we don't, this one wouldn't work because it says your stepdaughter mumbles something about wanting a new brother. Well, we don't technically have a stepdaughter, so that really wouldn't work. So I'm just going to roll again to see what we get. Okay, it says your wife found you making out with your ex-boyfriend. <laughs> what would you do? Break up, give one more chance, fight, or keep it secret? How would you keep it a secret? Okay, so your wife found you making out with your ex-boyfriend. Your wife found you making out with your ex boyfriend maybe girlfriend because I feel like his wife okay yeah so Nancy finds Joffrey cheating with his ex what do they do break up give one more chance fight or keep it secret um hmm I mean, we could roll a number one through four and see what they get. And then that's what they get, get I guess they do. So, let's see. One number from one to four. Number two. What was it? Give one more chance. Aww. Okay. So maybe what we'll do is we'll have them... Uh, well, if she's going to give him a chance... 
then this is where I wish I could set relationship levels because I would make their romance level down and maybe like their their friendship level down as well because obviously they'd be a little bit more rocky than what they are now because they're like maxed out and happy as can be so but I can't I don't have like MC command center in this save so we're just gonna have to leave it unfortunately but yeah so they're gonna have a second chance so we've done that one that one wasn't that one wasn't hard but it was interesting um, okay, so then we can go back to manage worlds real quick because nothing really happened there that we had to do anything about because if she's going to give him a second chance, then that's okay. All right, so that would have been nine, right? Yeah, nine. And then we're on ten. Why can't I click new crest? Oh, again. Okay, let's go do... Let's go do ten. The 10th household, it, which is the Munch household, which doesn't have the original Munches that you're thinking of. It just has the two sons. Um, the mom and the little boy. What's his name? Lucas? They don't live here. I don't know where they moved to, but they must have moved in with someone else because they don't actually live here. So, okay, all this stuff is popping up, so I'm trying to click it all out before anything else happens. Okay, so this is the Munch household, and we did the makeovers of these guys in the last ep uh, the last episode of this. We gave over the makeovers to <laughs> Dina. Dina uh, Caliente is married to. Gunther Munch and so she's taken on his last name so her name is now Dina Munch and then um, Gunther lives here but his mom like I said his mom moved out somewhere and took the little boy Lucas but left her teenage son Wolfgang here so that's kind of weird um, so he lives with his brother now and they all live here in this house which was technically their, um, like, childhood home, I guess. Because this is where they grew up with their mom. And if you don't know who their mom is, I think her name is Mila. <clears throat> and I guess she's married to Tomax. So they're probably all living over there. And I would assume Lucas is with his mom because he doesn't technically have a dad. None of these boys do. I don't know who they are. Oh my goodness. So I guess Gunther has a little boy named Carl with this lady, Tina. And she's in the managed households. She's in the households that aren't in the worlds. So what I think we should do is move her in with these guys. Because... We want him to be able to, we want him to be able to interact with his child. And also, I don't want the baby's name to be Carl Nance. So, Tina can stay Tina Nance, but I think Carl's last name should be Munch. That's going to be so weird, because like, poor Dina is going to have to live with it. We could maybe move out Tina and Carl, move them in here. And then move them out later on. I don't know how to do that. Um, yeah, he's still really romantic with Tina, too. How interesting. She's not interested in anyone other than Gunther. She must find him just extremely attractive. Okay, so that's a thing. Also, isn't he missing a trait? I feel like somebody was missing a trait. Let's see. One, two, three. One, two. Yeah, he's missing a trait. How weird. How wonky. All right, let's see if we can fix that. 
Um, I can... I can fix it. I just gotta find out how. Character traits. Let's add creative bookworm. I don't know. He was brought in with get together, right? So let's just do that. Insider. Maybe those lost few drinks weren't necessary. There we go. He's an insider now. <laughs> I had to give him a random trait and I gave him one from the pack he's from. It's random, but it's all right. Okay, so everyone is good here then. He wants to play an instrument and he wants to travel to the arts quarter. We're not traveling to the arts quarter at 1.35 in the morning, so you better find something better to do with your life. Also, I really want to change up this house. And here's the first thing I really want to do. <laughs> I, want to, I want to separate this into two bedrooms because it really irritates me that half and half is like how they did it and I just I can't stand it so I want to separate it especially if we're gonna be moving in those two people like we're probably just gonna have the girl sleep in this room and then put the baby in here whatever and so we need to have we need to have a better room for the baby for sure and then Wolfgang can probably just keep this bedroom because I'm I'm thinking he's probably gonna go off to college so we probably don't need to like you know give him anything too extravagant but, we also don't want to cheap him out, because this is his actual house, you know? He's not just moving in with some ran like, because he had woohoo with some rando person and had a baby with them. Um, yeah, and then this is, like, the mom's room. This is actually where they should put her, and they should just swap the beds. Is that even possible? Because this room is kind of small. But I wanted this room because it's got the thing. Can we get rid of like one of these bookshelves and put the computer in this corner? Move the bed outside for just a second. Put this in the center of the room like it should be. And you know what? We could actually probably do this like this. Hold on, hold on. I'm trying to move all of this around in here to the point that they can get around without issues but it also looks okay wait let's put that there what all right let's put this here do we think we could put that bed in here or what no, stop it. Um, let's just see if we can put this in here. The only reason I say that is I assume this was his bedroom. And that other room is his mama bear's bedroom. And I don't feel like he would want to sleep in his mom's bedroom. I feel like that would be weird. So, I'm going to put the bed in here. Right? I'm going to get rid of this lamp. It can go in the other room, I think. Put this here. Let's see. Can we shandangle this? Shandangling. I don't even know what that means. Making up words. Um. What's this? What's the colors we can put on this that maybe will match better? Because if not, like, maybe I could just delete this. Yeah, let's just delete the couch. Get rid of it. I don't like it. And we're going to put this here. It doesn't even... Do you notice that this doesn't even match this? But I mean, it's probably the best that there is. Oh, I don't like this bedroom. <laughs> I'm really struggling. I just feel like everything is so in a line. Alright, we're just going to have to live with it like this. And the carpet is going to have to be off-centered. And I'm just going to have to get over myself with my OCD and try and just look away. Okay, honestly, just look away. All right, let's put this in here. I know this is his mom's bed. I know that. I'm going to change that. I'm going to change it to a blue. So it looks like it came with this room. Maybe. No. You know what? We're just going to delete the bed altogether. We're going to move on and just find a different bed. It's just going to be great. 
We're just spending all their money. <laughs> um, okay, we're not going to go that expensive, okay? We're not. We're just... We're going to try and save her a, a few pennies here. No. What about this one? Two extravagant blankets. Okay. What about this one? It doesn't even look like... What? What? Oh. What about this bed? Oh, I just wanted like an easy swap -a -rooney. This was the bed that she had. I'm looking at more expensive beds. What am I doing? Okay. I'm just going to go with this bed. I don't know. It's like the only thing I could find. And I'm going to change the color of the wood. Because I don't like this wood. And it's freaking me out. Um. Okay. That kind of matches. What? I ate like two bites. I'm sorry. I couldn't eat anymore. My tummy hurted. All right, let's see. Um, I want this. Want this bed thingy. Let's change the color of these two to kind of match, maybe. If I can find something that matches. There we go. And then make these blue. Bam. There we go. That looks nicer. And then this could be like the guest bedroom, I guess. We could probably just take this whole light out of there and just bring these in. Why do they have... I'm confused. Why do they have things like this? I don't want this light, actually. I want this light. I'm going to take this light back. I'm going to put it over here by the desk, if I can, and make it blue. There we go. Very cute. All right. I just feel like this would be something that his, he would keep. Like, it's his mom's old bedroom, you know? So I just feel like he would feel kind of odd sleeping in her bed. Um, I know that that's, like, you know, the norm of people who take over their parents' rooms and things. But I just think Gunther is very different. He isn't that person. Like, he's not... I don't know. He's not the norm. Let's just put it that way. He's not the norm. So I feel like he wouldn't want to take over his mom's bed. I just think he would find that like really weird. So we're going to change this room to like a yellowy feel. Um, the curtains are kind of yellow already. So it's perfect. The only thing I really, really, really got to change is for one, I want to change this. And this, if I can. And this. And then I want to put on some different wallpaper that's yellow. Is there like a... We should push run on the thing, too. I forgot. I was going to do it before I sat down. You don't have to do it. It's alright. I'm not going to do that, either. I don't like that. And why does the flooring in this house not match? Why is there 700 different floorings? So I like this flooring. And I think the whole house should have this floor. Um, and I feel like the bathroom should have this floor. Okay? So I don't know what was going on with their thought process here. But it ain't cute. And we're getting rid of it. All right. So, let's go ahead and give a different wallpaper. <sighs> really trying to find one here. Save! Ah! <laughs> jerk. 
Okay, let's save. Saving! <sighs> Hydrate. <sighs> this is my hydration. <laughs> Cheers, matey. Okay. Completed. Let's go with this. That's pretty nice. I don't think it costs us any money. So that's what's even better. Okay. So now the house looks a little bit different. We've changed it up. Made it our own. Now I think we can move in that family. You know. And she can sleep in here. Then when the baby ages up. We could put the baby in here. And maybe kick her out. <laughs> Kidnapping. <laughs> Not really. Can't kidnap your own kid. I mean you can. But. <sighs> we're not going to. Okay. I'm going to move this because I really like it here. At, like when they're walking in. I just think it makes more sense. And then, okay, let's go ahead and go back in. Right? Okay. Is there anything else I need to do before I invite this lady to live with us? I don't think so. Oh, she wanted to become a freelance fashion photographer. Freelance freelance fashion photographer um the thing is for her aspiration which is what i base it off of um that's what she's supposed to have a job on so i'm actually going to unpin this and get rid of it because it doesn't really make sense for her and then she can pick something else she wants to buy a bar that makes more sense um Um, so, let's see. Uh, let's go ahead and play a computer game. And he wants to become a spellcaster from his paranormal hobby, which, if he really wants to, so be it, you know? Um, he wants to play an instrument, and he wants to travel to the arts quarter. I don't think he has an instrument, does he? Also, I hate that this is up, ag like, against this wall because of the way that I look at this house. So, I like to... I like to put this over here. Can I not? Seriously? Okay. Buddy. You have got to get off of the chess table because I'm moving it. Wait. Why can't I put this here? Can't intersect other objects. Okay. Hold on. What am I intersecting? This? I can't intersect the light? Oh my goodness gracious, great balls of fire. Okay, um, fine. Is there anything else I need to do before I move this lady in with her baby? Well, the baby, our baby. It's, you get it. Put this here. Just make it look nice. Uh, I think we're good. I'll probably put the bar either out here or right here in the corner of the kitchen. Or I might actually move some of this stuff around in here and put it in the dining room. That might make sense too. So when they have like dining parties, it's great. Okay. So I'm thinking that's good. Let's go ahead and save because I think that's everything. So we're going to save as... I could have just saved. What am I doing? Okay. Let's go ahead and just get this lady in here. It's going to add an extra flam blam to the, you know, for shizzle. Um, let's just go to manage worlds because we just saved and we're going to pull this lady in with the baby. Um, I got to remember which one she is. I'm not going to lie to you. Um, she's this one, Nance. So she is going to be moving in with this household. And like I said, the only reason I'm doing this is because I want him to be able to have a, like a, a, a relationship with his child. So we're going to move these guys in and then obviously we can change her up. Maybe she'll want to move out on her own. Which means I'm going to need to roll for her stuffy. Alright. I'll have to do that. I really need a second screen. What? It says, congratulations. T Tina has unlocked the hidden Sixum citizen aspiration. Be found with the other occult aspirations. The hidden? There's a hit. 
What? What is this? Visit the planet Sixum. <laughs> That's all you gotta do for that? <laughs> Alright. So this is Tina. You can't see her. She's got big glasses on. Um, she wants to be a master actress. Um, she is in no job at all. <laughs> she has some fishing, some mischief, and some mix mixology. She is romantic with Gunther. She is friends with Knox, Max, and her baby Carl, and Nancy Langrub. <laughs> she hates Judith. Who doesn't? Um... Nothing in her inventory. She is a romantic freaking da dance machine. She does not want a baby. She's an Aries. Um, she likes the color orange. She likes to play the violin. She wants to live in Oasis Springs. Oh, excuse me. She does not want to live in Oasis Springs. And she likes alternative music. So that's about her. And let's look at her family tree real quick, if I can find it. Because every single game has it in a different position, and I always forget which one is which. So all her family is is Carl, her son. And yeah, her co favorite color is orange. Alrighty. Let's go ahead and take Miss N Tina. Is that her name? Was it Tina or Nina? Tina. Let's take Tina in and get Tina a good makeover. Also, let's put the baby in Tina's bedroom. We'll put it right here. That's a good place for it. Wait, is the baby a... Is the baby an alien? Why is it wearing that outfit? What's up with that? Is the baby an alien? I'm confused. I don't think the baby is an alien. Adoption? Oh, you can click on the baby and put it up for adoption? Call adoption agency to look for a host family. Whoa. Whoa. That is too much. We're not putting our baby up for adoption. That is horrible. Okay. Um. Well, these guys aren't. <gasps> it is an alien. Tina's an alien. Oh my god, he had woohoo with an alien. Ugh. That's weird. <laughs> Develop based on pick sims. You might as well do it on Gunther because that's who he's attract she's obviously attracted to. Um, so we have our first alien. Mayday, mayday, we've made <laughs> we've made uh contact with <laughs> with the alien species. We need help. Um, so we'll define this by this. And then, let's see. I think that's everything there. That's everything there. We did attractiveness. Remove disguise. Ugh. No, so I'm not sure I want to see that. What was that? What? I don't know. I saw something weird. <laughs> it's a ghost. <laughs> All right, let's go ahead and edit her in Cass. What? <laughs> you have 7.7 7, thousand simoleons you can use on my stream? Yep, yeah, right down there. Oh, oh, I was really confused. Wow, that's a lot. Um, we need cast dot full edit mode. All right, now let's see modifying cast, I believe. Alexa, mm. Mm -hmm. Oh my gosh, she just gave me a freaking fright of my life. 
Okay, what was he going to be? Festivalist. Oh my gosh, I forgot. I added in like a traits thing. So there's like a whole bunch of new traits that we can add. So like this is the traits. Dreamer. Festivalist. Grumpy. I don't know why that's not in the game, let's be honest. Um, Plant-based. They're like vegans. Un no, Sims who stutter, which I think is really cool. It's very realistic. Unfunny. Bas basketballer. I don't know if that would be a trait, but all right. Gamer. I mean, come on. Handy. Loves sweets. Um, makeup enthusiasts. There's some women out there like that. Movieholic. There's a social media addict. There are some people like that too. Um, then there's club goer, coffee holic, <laughs> fall lover, um, healthy lifestyle, uh, gold digger. I was waiting for you to point at me and I was going to punch you. Um, Salvadoradian roots, um, <laughs> skeptical. That's totally me. Spring lover. That's also me. Tea drinker, summer lover. That is Definitely not me. I hate the freaking summer. <laughs> Star quality. Unfaithful. Winter lover. Then there's bubbly. Com oh. And then we have like committed. Um, guilty. Loyal. Twice. But that's right. Need intimacy. Nostalgic. Um, mm. Social anxious. Um, supernatural fans, true-hearted, tempting, unfaithful, and, un and untrustworthy. Okay, so he was what? An insider? Is that what I said? I think so. Honestly, just want to randomize for the rest, but I know I can't. Um... Where is Insider? I don't see it. I see Creative and I see Bookworm. I don't see Insider. Am I blind? Insider. Oh. These are in alphabetical order for a reason, folks. And it's not here. I swear it's not here. What? <laughs> Alright, well I guess I'll just have to pick some different ones for him then. I don't know. Mm. Really, they only need three. But I've got a mod where I can have five. So I probably should just give him five. So that it makes people more like... Mm. Different. I don't know how to choose what he would get though. So let's do this. Let's remember creative and bookworm. Mm -hmm. Here we go. Alright, we're going to take off those two. And then I'm going to put on bookworm. Oh, ho, 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 creative. Bumps. So he got oh, hates the outdoors. Guilty. So this means guilty sims are sad. Live in the past. They keep regretting over and over again anything they have done or said before. And it keeps hurting them. And he's a gamer. Oh, that's cute. Okay. So Wolfgang is mean and gloomy. Right? Let's randomize. Take off these two. So let's do mean and gloomy. There's gloomy. Where's mean? I feel like that's like a social thing. There we go. Okay, so he got social anxious. Sims with this disorder have a mental health condition. They may experience an intense fear that can affect work, school, and other day-to-day -day activities. They're usually sad, and sometimes they need to talk about it. Oh, poor guy. All right, so that's going to be him. 
And then we're going to go for her. She She's ambitious, romantic, and active. So ambitious, romantic, active. Okay, so ambitious, romantic, and active. Active. Romantic. And then ambitious. She's also childish and good. Okay, and then we have the baby, which we can't we can't edit the baby. But we can edit Tina. She is romantic, a freegan, and a dance machine. So she is romantic. Uh, I thought dance machine was in here. Maybe it's in this one. Dance machine and a freegan. She also got child of the wild or child of the ocean and self-absorbed, which those are from the game. So that's all good in the hood. I am not going to edit this part of her because this is her like alien skin and I don't think that needs to be edited. So I'm going to swap over to her disguise and that's what I'll edit because it just makes more sense to me personally to do that. So what I'm going to do is um, I'm not going to edit her face or anything like that. I will give her a different hairstyle. I'm going to take off the glasses. She can keep the nose ring. I'm going to take off the earrings though. Um, just because... I want to find earrings that I think fit her outfit. She's actually a pretty cute alien. Like, the disguise, obviously. Take off the accessories, the shoes, and the outfit. Okay. So now let's find her a hair. And also, I want to change her eyes. Just slightly. Uh... I think I'm going to do this just because I want to get rid of those, like, ugly EA eyelashes. Um, let's do a hairstyle for her. She's got, like, a medium hairstyle, so we'll go medium for her. Because there it is, medium hairstyle. So let's just look and see what hairstyle we think looks good on her. I kind of think she needs something like a hairstyle that's shaved on one side of her head, but then it's not shaved on the other side of her head, maybe. I feel like that would fit her. Like very... I don't know what you'd call that kind of a hairstyle. Um, I don't know what it would be called. I can't think of it. Like kind of like this, but maybe shaved on one side of her head. That would be really cool. Do we even have hairstyles like that? Or I'm going to have to like download one. We have this. Okay. I totally think this might work. Man, I did not expect to get right into the game and go into Cass. All right. Um. All right. Let's go ahead and let's take off the glasses. And we need to put on the nose ring. Um, where is the nose ring? I don't, I think this is called like a bull ring or something. I don't know. What's the, what's the earring that goes through your like nose right here? I don't think he can hear me. Ignoring. All right, um, I'm just going to keep giving her the earring. She seems to have the hair set for sure. So we just got to get the nose ring. Squared away. All right. Okay. And then this is the last... The last one. 
All right, and then she liked, well, she was wearing the color orange. So let's go with orange yeah. and see what we can come up with. Orange. Okay. Um, I don't have a story for her. I feel like she'd be very eccentric, though. So maybe let's go with this and put orange shoes on her. I kind of like that. It's kind of very different. It does make her stand out from the crowd, that's for sure. And I feel like that would be her style. Like, I don't know, very just different. Okay, let's go ahead and do some fingernails for her real quick. And we could do these ones because those are really nice. And we'll do toenails in orange because her favorite color is orange. And then she's not married or anything, so she should be good. And then let's just try and find some, some more clothes for her. She's really pretty, personally. I think so, anyways. I think she's a really pretty sim. I can see why he would be attracted. Just changing all the nails. I'll go through and do... Um, I don't know how much makeup she'd wear. Just because she is an alien. So who knows how much she would actually wear. But... I mean, I guess if you're trying to fit in, maybe you'd wear a bunch. I don't know. Let's get her in this. And let's get her in this. There we go. And then... I do think her son, their son together, I do think he's an alien. I really do. So that would be an interesting story. Um, to try and explain, you know. Alright, I think just black sneakers will be good here. And then let's just do her fingernails because her toenails don't really need it. Um, because she is, um, she's all good. Alright, for this, she could just wear like this. Oh my goodness, what did she got on her legs? Um, this is weird. Take that off. Let's do, oh, fingernails, can do these, and then I guess for her shoes, she could probably keep them and just do them in like yellow, and then I kind of like this for this, so let's just see, can we make these like brown, yeah, and then let's do nails. And I guess she could have toenails, though you're not really going to see them. Um, for this... That's not orange. We'll do that. Take off all of this stuff on you. That's too much. Um, and then toenails would be orange. That would be good. Hot attire. Let's see. Maybe. Ooh, let's go with this. That looks nice. That looks really nice. All right, and then we'll just do all of our norms. Changing the shoes because I just think that that doesn't really match. I wish that was a little bit darker to match that belt. It would be perfect. But we'll go with like a white to match the belt. The actual belt piece. Uh, like the buckle is what I'm getting at. Um, and then. Let's see. Oh my goodness girl. Alright that's fine. She can wear that with these boots. Um, let's just wear them. Um, like that. And then let's go ahead and do fingernails. 
And I think that would be it for this. Let's just go ahead and give her eyelashes for one. Even if they're like technically fake, whatever. Um, let's just do these. These make her pop a little bit more, like her eyes for sure. And then, hmm. Okay. And maybe let's do a little bit of makeup on her. Let's just do like a little bit on her cheeks maybe. Not that much. Whoa, that's too much. Um, okay, I don't even really see a difference, so never mind. Maybe let's just do like a little bit on her lips so she can look like her lips are pink instead of brown. Whatever you'd call that. They're not pink. That's okay. We'll do that one. And we'll do it on all the outfits, maybe? Why is that light flickering? I don't know. Can't handle it. No, it was hurting my eye. Okay. Um... I mean, honestly, if I seen her walking down the street, I would not think alien, so. The disguise must be good. Alright. I think that's good. I like, I like her. I think she's really good. Okay. Let's go ahead and get out of here. Like I said, I'm not going to alter her alien self. Because I just feel like, like... Honestly, what am I going to do to an alien? Okay. So. Now, the baby is needing some lovin's. So, let's have her go take care of the baby. Um, just do all that stuff. And then let's get you guys inside for one. You want to play a computer game. Play Blick Block. All right. He wants to play foosball or something. Order a pizza. Can everyone just leave the baby alone? The baby is being taken care of. Let's leave the baby alone. Leave the baby alone. Um. Order a delivery. Pizza delivery. Do kebab pizza. Can you guys leave? While she's taking care of the baby, please. Use... Did you order the pizza? What is this man doing? I don't think he ordered anything. Okay, did it say we ordered it? No, it didn't. Order pizza. Why are you not ordering a pizza, bro? What's wrong with you? Oh, uh, wait, is our phones not on? No, not that. Oh, you know what we could do? You know, why don't we have premium? Let's be honest. All right, now let's order a pizza. We should get it now. Kebab. Yes. <sighs> All right, Tina. Pizza's on the way. I'm excited. I hope we have a pizza delivery person. I'm a little bit concerned I forgot to set up one. Oops. Carl is very hungry. 
Didn't she feed him? All right, well, she's feeding him now, nonetheless. All right, now he wants to play darts. So we have a dartboard out here. So let's go ahead and practice and see if that counts. Her whims have disappeared, which is kind of funky in itself. Also, I need to... I need to finish giving Teen all her things and stuff and things. So, she's an Aries. She doesn't want a baby right now, so we need to give her birth control. Because if you don't want kids, that's your best bet. Um, so, let's give her a box of that. Let's pop these in here. We'll unpack it, and she can take one. There we go. She has taken that, so she doesn't have to worry about it. We'll stop those when she's ready to have a baby again. There is no pizza delivery, I'm assuming, because it's not really working. Okay. Um. No. Please just leave this baby alone. Please. I'm actually going to lock this door. Four. And I'm going to put everyone but Tina. And then I am going to allow access to Gunther because it's the dad. Everyone else can stay out. Um, attend a health checkup. Sure. And also, Wolfgang, I'm going to let you lock your door too. So lock for everyone but Wolfgang. Where is it? There. Oh, there we go. Perfect. Oh, he's sad from his panic disorder. Poor guy. All right. Can you actually play this with Dina? Because I think you actually have to play like a, a physical game. You can't just like, you know, do whatever. Um, and then we're going to roll for some stuff for Tina. But she needs to do something to get some points. So we could do a whim. But she doesn't have any over her head. Well, that's unfortunate. Um, or we could have her do one of these things. So maybe we'll have her practice acting for two hours in the mirror. And maybe she'll feel better and have a great time. Huh? So let's have her do that. Ah. Okay. Neep, wanoosh, in a preps. Oh, neep. Can you just stop with that and just play this game with him? Thanks. What are you doing? <laughs> What is leaning getting you? <laughs> Alright, so she's actually acquired the Wanoosh. acting skill. Dolphus oh, here we go. Buddha. She wants to win a game of dart win Go a game Papa. of darts. And she wants to have a drink at the club. She doesn't sound like a mom to me if you asked me. Alright. Is he like games? Tired. Tried, I mean. He does probably like games, doesn't he? Because he's a gamer. I mean, come on. Gunther wants to play video games so bad. <laughs> Me. Um, I should have never said and done that. Hope they don't... I hope they would forgive me one day. Oh, poor guy. Alright, he is up to video gaming level 3. But we're going to have him stop because he's about to pee his pants. So let's have him use... And we need to get Oh man. We need a we need a grocery grocery deliverer or a pizza delivery person. <laughs> so let's go ahead and set one of those up. I'm gonna just do it on this lady that's walking by because I don't know who she is. And if she's ours later on, you know. We'll figure it out, but I'm looking for pizza delivery, pizza delivery specialist. There we go. Perfect. Okay. So that means now we should be able to order a pizza. Did he, well, he got, pro, he got progress for it, but I'm actually going to have him do it again. 
Order a delivery. Pete, uh, pizza's already on the way. Oh, okay. Maybe when she leaves this town. Whoa, where'd she go? Oh, there she is. Maybe when she, like, disappears out, she'll come with our pizza. I don't know. Probably not. But we can be helpful, right? Gunther, what are you doing? Gunther? Gunther? <laughs> Alright, Dina ended up beating Wolfgang 5-3. to three. Off target. What is this? Embrace him and she wants to buy a bar. That's what she wanted to do. I forgot what she wanted to do and I couldn't remember and I was trying to see and she didn't have it there. So I was like, what, what, what did she want? But it was a bar. Now I remember. See? Um... Where are the bars? Oh, here they are. Let's go with... What color is this household stuff? Oh, it's not really any specific color, though. We could go black just because, you know, a lot of the house has black in it. So what would happen if we went this color? I wonder if they could even walk between that. This house doesn't even have a living room now that I've realized it. Like, that's, I guess, their living room. But that's weird because it's not even connected to the house. It's really weird. Um, I don't know. We're just going to leave it there and see how it goes. We're not joining the detective career. Sorry. All right. If she wants to embrace him, she should just, like... Call him over. I'm gonna have her go here, and I'm gonna have Gunther go here because she can't come in this room. And it's only fair that you know he goes to where she can get to him at. So let's do this romance, um, embrace. Oh, cute. All right, she wants to make an excellent drink. So let's go ahead and let's make a drink for Gunther. All right, they're just really getting into it. Wolfgang, what is wrong with you? <laughs> complain about apartment problem. Click on the active apartment problem and run the complaint to landlord. There is no landlord here. You've lost your mind. Okay, I guess that didn't work with the pizza delivery. Unless this lady still hasn't left. But I think those chances are slim to none. So... Like, I really don't like all the NPCs spawning. But at the same time, I kind of hate the fact that... Every single time I use NPCC, like, nobody spawns. And that's kind of annoying. Okay, let's see. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. And she's in what? What is Master Actress under? Creativity. So she's going to be a creative sim, for one. For two, is she an adult? She is. Okay. So we need a second number. One through eight, I think. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. That's eight. Give me number one through eight. Four. He said four. One, two, three, four. All right. Knowledge. And then... Hobbies. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. One through fourteen. Three. One, two, three. Fashion and beauty. Wow. What? Um, and then she isn't a family sim or a romance sim, so we don't need to worry about any of that stuff. 
and then we're good there. So that's everything for her. So she got knowledge and creativity. Creativity main, is her main. And then fashion and beauty is her hobby. Which I could kind of see it because she's trying to fit in and she's trying to be an actress. So it kind of works. It does. It kind of works for her. So yeah. Uh, let's go ahead and just move forward. All right. These guys need some food. We need to do something. Um, let's have you stop. Make a special drink. Cupid juice. Um. I don't know what this is. It's a Christmas holiday tradition drink. All right. Well, that's not going to do it. Make drink. Make favorite drink. Hopefully it's excellent quality. Okay, she can stop. She's been going forever. Is that Lucas? Is he coming to see us? Is that Lucas? It totally is. Why don't you go out and, inter and, and talk to your brother? Um, I don't know. Couldn't, like, invite him in or anything. Did you make an excellent quality one? Make candles. Okay. Go ahead and drink that. What's he eating? Nothing? Oh, okay. She's just gonna drink some water. I really wish we could cook, but we can't because we don't have any food. Um, can we buy groceries? How do you go grocery shopping? Like, how do you physically go grocery shopping? Um. Oh, he's off to school. What about Dina? Dina's not doing much. Dina! Let's see. Order. Order. Oh, you can do that? Man, that's cool. We should have done that. Um, I didn't know that was a thing or else I would have done it. How do we go grocery shopping? Seriously, I'm really confused. I don't get it. Split from household. No. Um, I guess you're just supposed to order a delivery, but I feel like the person's not going to bring the food. So I feel like it's going to be a waste of my money. And we've ordered like six pizzas. They're not showing up. So I don't know if I could even order another pizza at this rate because... I don't feel like they're getting uh, delivered to us. Let's see. P that's the pizza delivery. Where is like the... I don't even know what that person's called that like delivers the groceries. What are they even called? Um, like Zoomers or something. I don't know. Uh, first, no... Grocery shop owner? Grocery deliverer. That's what we want. Alright, now if we order groceries. Let's see if we can do this. Order a delivery. Groceries. So we're just going to get like a bunch of stuff. Because I mean... I don't really know what they would need. You know? So, let's just get, like, uh-oh, there's a storm coming. Just gonna buy a couple of things. Onions. I love how I say a couple of things. I buy everything on the menu. 
Um, we'll get the potatoes, some raspberries, some sage. We'll get some salmon. Lettuce. Mushrooms. A pumpkin. We have some watermelon. Some spinach. Some strawberries. Some sugar. Get that. Get some red meat and some white meat. Alright, I think this is going to be good, guys. This is going to be good. Alright, let's wait for it to be delivered. Yakalau Dunba. Brugi Payoon. <laughs> okay. Reginu. I'll gather your order and send a delivery sim right over to your address. Sounds fantastical. Hey, get out of my room. You freaking nerd. Alright, why don't you play with Gunther? Yeah. Who is this lady? Um, did you bring me my groceries, bro? Because otherwise you ain't welcome. <laughs> you can't just come in my bedroom and sit on my bed. That's not how this life works. What are you wearing to work? Okay. Sayonara, bring me my groceries. Hi, Alexander. Welcome to my household. Lady. <laughs> Where are you going, though? At work. Alright. I really hope she comes back with my groceries. Ugh. Everyone's gonna starve in this household because we can't get groceries. Oh my goodness. Okay, these guys are playing uh, darts. She wants to win. So we're waiting to see the end game. Score. Please tell me my groceries are actually coming, though. About to cheat the system. Okay. Dirk, Dirk's walking by. Um, while taking a quick break, Wolfgang spies some money just sitting on a sink in the bathroom. Should he slide in his locker for safekeeping or just turn it into the principal? He would save it. He would not turn it in. He is a horrible kid. Lost money gets reported and the principal orders a full locker sweep. Wolfgang gets caught with the money and sent to detention. Performance loss of small. That don't surprise me. Let's be honest. I might have to get rid of the simple living lot trait so that we can make food. Because, like, I don't think the person's bringing our food. They're not. They don't care. They do not care. The only other thing I could think of to do is to buy more groceries. But, like, do I want to keep spending money on things that I don't need to buy? Probably not. So, I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to, uh... I think I'm going to take off that trait for right now so they can make some food. No. It blinked because of the storm. Um, It's the simple living lot thingy. We could randomize one more time. They have cursed. It just got grody. So we'll just put grody and cursed on and take off simple living for right now. Because it's not working and we need them to be able to eat. Okay, I really want this to work for her. And I really want her to win this game of darts. But I feel like she's not even close to winning. I wonder how people play with this and... um. Like this NPCC. I wonder how they play with it and have it so they can like get these groceries delivered. Or do they just not care about that part of the game and they don't... I don't know how that works. Like how do people set this up so that they have all these different people that they need. Like a repairman and stuff. Like if you guys have any suggestions, I am all ears and I am listening. Um, Gunther ended up beating Tina, so that didn't work. Tina lost. 
Well, Tina, <laughs> she's a sore loser. <laughs> That's what it says. All right. Um, well, Tina doesn't have a job, so... I guess we're just going to have her serve up some brunch for everyone. We're going to have her make up some um, fruit salad. And the baby's crying. Um, did you see that? When I get far enough away, the baby disappears. That's really creepy. He has a very echoey cry. Alright, let's go ahead and bounce him and coo at him, cuddle him, make a silly face, and rock him. He cries so loud. Alright, Tina, you chopped that fruit. Getting it. Gunther has met Leah while at work. Alright. I think Tina's pretty happy here. <laughs> she looks awfully happy. That smile on her face hasn't wiped off for one second since she's moved in. Your son's crying, so hurry. Hurry in. We have a storm coming in, so if I lose connection, that's why. Um, that's why I'm also going to be saving more frequently. Because it is pelting the house. <laughs> so, I will try to save more frequently so we don't lose a lot. Uh, Gunther also met Francine. Wow, Francine. What? Yeah. I don't want to lose anything, but I'm going to keep saving. Check if food is still fresh. Huh? <laughs> Since when is that a thing? Um, can we not see if it's fresh? Yeah, we can. It's, you can see if it's still... If, how long until it's spoiled. All right, put that away when you're done. Taking care of the... Bobby. All right. We could probably harvest some stuff. Oh, too many errors. Gunther's boss is a bit of a diva, but the latest story was some huge errors in it. Should Gunther work late to make sure everything is fixed and perfect? Or just fix the most obvious ones and call it a day? Um, He's a very hard worker, so he would work hard. Gunther's boss is so impressed, she might start asking for help with actual writing. Performance gain of medium. Nice. But it's not really going to make a difference. It's not really going to make a difference if he doesn't, you know, like, um, want to get a promotion. Because he won't even get those skills built that he needs. So it'll be pointless. Well, I guess right now he doesn't need any skills. But he needs to read books, but he doesn't ever want to, so. And then Dina looks like a friggin' crazy lady. With her fishing hat on. I don't know why she's got a fishing hat to be a dishwasher. But so be it. And then um, Wolfgang here is just at school. And he actually needs to go to the bathroom. Severe thunderstorm warning. He just keeps telling me. All these things keep popping up. Alright, the baby needs a butt change too, I think now. So change that stanky diaper. And then you can go and put this away. And then I'm going to let you go to bed for... Or I'm going to let you take a nap for a little while because you're kind of tired. Disco napping. I don't even know what that means. How do you disco nap? What's a disco nap? Does it just mean you like dream about discos all the time while you're sleeping? She has high blood pressure. Um, Did I ever put in an actual hospital? I can't even remember. Um, I think I did. Ooh, Tina could go to the hospitale. Yeah, let's do it. Tina. Um, a full evasion of patient's health. It costs zero simoleons. Yeah, my health checkup has been scheduled for Friday at 6. Holy schmokies, could it not be any sooner? Does it have to be Friday? Friday. Um, let's see. 
What are we even, how long are we even with this household? Do I even know? I don't even have them on the thing. Okay, this is ridiculous. <laughs> what is wrong with me? Um, Sunday, Monday, Tuesday. So Wednesday, Thursday. Friday is actually our last day with these guys. Today is the first day, I guess. Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday. So Gunther met Salem as well. And Wolfgang is done with school today. All right, Wolfgang, what do you want to do, bro? He wants to eat. Troll the web forums. Totally sounds like him. Um, let's go to the web. Um, how do you troll the web forums? Socialize? Yeah. Troll the forums. There we go. Yes. Now he wants to send a text. Who is he friends with at work? Or er, school. Um, also, he could get leftovers. He is irritatingly insensitive. He walks... He... It says Wolfgang lacks... An astonishing amount of empathy. He is currently on course to remain insensitive as an adult. It's advisable to correct this. Least he wish to forever come out, off as a llama's rump. Oh, righty. Oh, he's going to come off as a llama's rump. And you know why? Because he does. he's never going to want to fix that. And there's nothing I can do about it. If you don't wish it, I don't do it. All right. I think he should serve up some garden salad, though. Because that would be a good idea. Um, let's see. He's really pelting this window. Let's save again. Because we're going to be really efficient with this. And it only takes like a split second to do so. He's always so sad. I feel so bad for him. What are you doing, Tina? Tina? Who told you to do, you could do that? Oh, Gunther has now met Gavin while at work. He is just meeting everyone and their brother. Whoa! <laughs> um, should she firmly embrace with her astonishingly sculpted arms that she likes fitness? Sure. Uh, <laughs> if you like fitness, you go for you? it, girl. Who might tell you no? She doesn't really have anything she really wants to do, so... It's all good in the hood. It's all good in the hood. All right. We're just waiting on him to finish the salad so he can eat. Oh, I totally look like that when I make a salad. You know, I throw the bowl up in the air and I spin it around. <laughs> spin the knife on my finger. <laughs> I could never because I'm so clumsy. <laughs> I could never. I would literally like throw the knife in the air and I'd like stab myself in the foot. It doesn't seem possible, but it is. <laughs> All right. Um, excuse me, Miss Thang. Why are you always on my computer? Are you trying to talk to your own kind? Because I don't think Dina appreciates. <laughs> so you might want to get moving. Adopt a dog? Yes, please. All right. She really needs to come in here and take a nap. So like, you need to get out. Please. 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 <laughs> get out. Put this away. All right. He wants to play the guitar. Does he even have a guitar? Because, bro, I don't think you have a guitar. And... Ugh. Well, yeah, he doesn't have a guitar, but they have one right here. All right, let's play it. Practicing. That way he can play his guitar to his heart's content. He also wants to play football. Um, so we need to get him a soccer ball because that's a good idea. Um, where is soccer? Where's the soccer ball? Here it is. In my where I'm from, I call this a soccer ball. To each their own, though. All right. I'm gonna let him play the guitar either until he stops or until he improves his skill. 
That's how I kind of do that. When they pick to build a skill or play a skill item or work on a skill item, I guess. Um, I let them do it until they either build the skill or they stop on their own. So he can do that. She's going to go to the bathroom. She doesn't really have a lot that I can do for her. Um, she could get at the actress career, though, because she does have the actress um, lifetime or like the aspiration. So let's go ahead and have her jump into that career. Find a job. We'll get her into the actress career. Um, yeah. All right, actress is where it's all at for her. So let's do that. Let's select an agency. She can go with the AI staffing. He's met Mike while at work. I don't know what that means. Okay. All right, so she joined that staff. Now, she can check for open auditions. <laughs> and she can only do two. So she can do Vladislaw's uh, hardware or the void bop and fitness two or handiness two. I think she'd be more fitness and handiness. So we'll go with that because she likes fitness. So we got to get her to fitness two. She's out of fitness one. So that means, oh, does she, the only hard thing about these careers is like, you're never going to know if they actually want to do well, you know? So it does make it a little bit hard. So what I'm going to do, I guess unless she rolls a wish to work on a skill or like get a skill point, I'm not going to, or like get a promotion or something I guess I won't work on that skill that she needs and she'll just never get a job I guess I don't know I don't know how else to tell who's gonna do what when it comes to like active careers all right Gunther made 80 simoleons today and does he have a banking account open let me see Yes, he does. And it's all his money is going into that. And I'm going to do the same for Tina. So let's get Tina to open up a banking account. And all of her direct deposit is going to go in here. Perfect. Okay. <gasps> do you see what she's going to do? Is Gunther going to go for it? Oh, Dean is awake. What is she eating? What? Where'd she get a BLT sandwich from? <gasps> oh, scandalous. I got to get a photo. I got to get a photo. Can we get Dina in the background? Oh, that's perfect. Snapping. Perfect. He's really cheating out front of the house on his wife who's inside. And we just totally snapped a photo of it. Blackmail. No, I'm just kidding. Um, is this lady absolutely out of her mind? I don't know who's going to keep Gunther, but I feel like it's going to be a fight to the death. Okay, she wants to make candles, and since she wants to do that, right, so they don't have a candle-making thingamajiggy, uh, so I'm going to have to buy one for them. So let's go ahead and get a candle makey thing. <laughs> I can't even think of the words. Words are hard. Um, Let's see. Where is it? It's on a creative. What am I doing? Still, where is it? Here it is. All right, candle making. Uh, I think this color. Yeah, this color defo matches the best, I would assume. So let's see, where could we put this? You know what? We could probably put it right here in the hallway. And then let's just grab another light. So she's got a little bit of 
light over there to do it with. And let's go ahead and have her... Oh my gosh, are you kidding? We need bits and pieces from a recycling. Rummage this for or sorting. What? We have to go dumpster diving for these? Holy shenanigans. Okay. Can we rummage for bits and pieces, bits and bobs in this? No. Ah, oh, goodness. Welp, that was useless. Bought something I can't even use. I'm killing it. She's really tired. She also wants to adopt a dog, and I'm totally for that. So, maybe. He's eating fruit salad. Really, bro? There's salad in there. You could have ate that, and that would have been more appropriate. What is she going to do now? Oh, boy. I'm scared having her here. She's making my life crazy. Bonded groggy. Um, Wait, his mom is calling and is wondering if, if he wants to go over to her house and hang out. Um, yes, we do. Accept and travel with Sims. Let's bring Dina and Wolfgang. And we're not going to bring Tina. That's weird. <laughs> hey, mom, do you want to meet my baby mama? Here she is. This is also my wife, by the way. We're one happy triangular family. Um, okay. So they live in the vampire world. Is that what they're living in? Is that what this is? No, this is this is the um magic world. I've never seen this room. Oh my god, is that where poor Lucas lives? Oh, poor child. Wow, this place is sparsely decorated. Um Okay. Small little kitchen there. Nice bathroom. Wow. Okay, maybe not. Maybe Lucas lives here. Because that's... It's pretty extravagant. And then they live up here, I would assume. And then they have, like, one more bedroom downstairs. Okay. That could work. Alright. Okay. Um, we need to go in and go to the bathroom. Because we are about to pee our pants. So, <laughs> Hey, Mom. Gotta go pee. <laughs> See you later. <laughs> What does she want to do now? Oh, she wants to knit. Wow. She also wants to send a text message. Um, send it to your sister, I guess. Done. He wants to tell stories and play football. I swear Wolfgang is obsessed with football. But let's do this. <laughs> <laughs> Seems like a weird relationship. Um, let's see. Tell an engaging story. Um, why don't you give him a friendly introduction since he's like, you know, with your mom? Um, tell her a dramatic story. And tell her a funny story. Good. It doesn't look like Lucas is here. It doesn't. Alright, why don't you go to the bathroom? He's mortified. What did you say to him, Dina? Jeez. Um. Let's give yourself a pep talk. Why did all their lights just go out? I'm really confused. It's getting funky up in here. Alright, Wolfgang. You now want to have a dream date. From being a pleasure sim. Is there anyone that he perceives as attractive? Other, like... Oh, Luna. So Luna might be his, like, love. Who knows? Um, he doesn't have a good enough relationship, I don't think, to ask her out on a date. So, yeah. He's going to have to work on that if he wants to take her out on a date. Play ping pong. Ping ponging. You redeemed save. 
Oh my goodness. Saving. <laughs> Saved. All right, there we go. Um, What's this? Join a club gathering. Why does she have BLTs in her pocket? That's interesting. She can't even start a club gathering because there's no one else in her club. So. Sad times. <laughs> um, What is he doing? Are you joking with me right now, Gunther? You're just in here on the computer. Your mom invites you over and you just go... I'm going to go use the bathroom, and then I'm going to get on your computer without you knowing. Deuce. Huh. Interesting. Why don't you come meet Tomax? Or that's at least how I would think it's said. And Dina, why don't you meet him as well, since, you know, your mother-in-law is married to this man. So, let's do that. Let's get you all to meet him. He wants to go on a dream date. Well, dream date it will be. But we need to have him work with... The only sim that I see that he could possibly even get with is Luna. <laughs> dag, dag. And they are not even uh, friends. Yeah. So. <laughs> but he does perceive her as very attractive. So it is... A very huge possibility that he may want to go on a dream date with her, knowing that she's the only sim that he could, and for the fact that he finds her very attractive. But yeah. Um, I love how Mila is sleeping on this, like, I would consider this to be servant quarters at this rate, because they are, like, so small, and just, no. Okay. I think we should go home, though, because Dina is, like, going to pass out on the floor. Literally. Um, so, and it is, it is 11 o'clock at night. And Aww. Wolfgang would have school tomorrow. So, his mom would not approve of him being here anymore. Um, Wolfgang is feeling trapped, powerless, and embarrassed. Okay, well. All right. Let's go ahead and have them all stop talking. So, we can head. See, I told you. Told you she was going to pass out on the floor. Called it. All right. We're going to go ahead and have them head home because, like I said, it's getting it's getting very late for them. So, and we only went because it was their, their mama bear calling. But, like, we got to make sure we, you know, take care of our sims needs, too. But at least we got to meet Tomax because they've never met him before, which I feel a little bit weirded out about because that means she literally... She literally married this man, you know, and moved in with him and ditched her sons here and just never even had them meet him before she ditched them. So it's a little bit weird. A little bit. All right, let, oh my goodness, he wants to be abducted by aliens. Welp, now we know. Sleeping. Okay, let's go ahead and get everybody to bed. I don't know why his whims changed. That's weird. I don't know why that happened. Um, but yeah. These guys Ooh, are Lala. good to go. Dina and Gunther, they're both very tired. Well, she's extremely tired, but he is tired. Wolfgang is tired, so... And Tina is tired, so... The only one that's not tired is the baby. And we're gonna go ahead and take care of his little booty cheek so he shuts it up. So she can sleep. So that the time can fast forward. Okay, her parenting skill is about to level up, which is awesome sauce. There we go. Levelage. What did she need to do? Read something and travel to the arts quarter. 
All right, when she's done, let's just have her sleep because it is, you know, one o'clock in the morning and most people sleep at this time. Also, I want to auto lights to all lights. So the only lights that are on are this room. I do like that about this game. And they actually work properly. Not like, you know, The Sims 3 and things. The Sims 3 used to work like that, but they don't like work like that anymore. It's Carl's birthday! Okay, kid. Really though, bro? We literally just laid back down and now you're crying again. Sleeping. Alright. Okay, so we're gonna definitely see him age up and then we'll find out what we're gonna do with Tina after that, you know? I only moved them in because I knew that Tina would need a place to go because she wasn't really going to have enough money to get her own place in secondary because we wanted Gunther to be able to interact with his child. So it does make sense. Use and take a bath. I think there is a cheat <laughs> that I could do to make him get abducted by aliens. Um... But I don't really want to cheat, honestly. But. Here's my next question. Alien abduction. Yeah, see, I can. There is one. Is she able to have him be abducted? Because, like, wouldn't that be... Wouldn't that make sense? Since she's an alien? Or does, is that weird? I don't really know yet. I don't really know if that would be normal for an alien to be able to abduct you. Or, like, call someone down to abduct you, I guess. I don't know. I'm not an alien, so I can't answer that question. All right, let's go ahead and get some breakfast. Let's get some leftovers. Dina's still sleeping. Wolfgang is ready for the bathroom. So we're gonna have him use, take a bath. He wants to order pizza again, that never works. And he wants to play ping pong. Today is the season or the TV season premiere, so we could check that out if we wanted. Another uh, U.S. National Weather Service alert has just come through. Um, so, keeping everyone up to date. <laughs> um, let's see. He will need some leftovers as well. And Dina, she is still sleeping. She can be sleeping for a little while. From coming down with something. Dean's throat is feeling some major discomfort. Inner child's ply. Okay. And then she is just hungry. But I would like her to use the bathroom first. So let's do that. He really wants to read something. And I think this is also for his job. So let's have him read something. Like seriously. Read books, not started. See? Perfect. Alright, the baby is crying. So let's get her to take care of his little baby needs. We are going to age him up today. Because it is his birthday, like I said. So once we age him up, we should be okay to go. Or we should be, like, okay on having to take care of him every five seconds. Wolfgang, you need to get out of there because you need to go eat. And other people are trying to use the bathroom, so... Come on, Vamanos. Alright, how's it going? I still feel like maybe we should have him be abducted. Or, the only other thing I can think of that maybe we could do... Is we could somehow get the thingy where you can, like, summon aliens 
to your home by putting it on your lot somehow. It's like from the science career or whatever. And just make it so that it's like he created it himself and then he's like summoning aliens down onto him. Because otherwise, I don't really know how to get abducted. But it is something that I would like to do for him because he is a knowledge sim and it just makes sense. So, yeah. Okay, she's about to go to the bathroom. And I do want to age Carl up today, but does he work today? No, he actually has today off, so we can do it. We can do it in a little bit once we get like Wolfgang off to school and stuff. Did he finish his breakfast? He did. No, you're not trolling the forums. You're about to go to school in like one minute. There you go. Sayonara, right. sucker. Have a good time. All right, and then when she's done in the bathroom, let's let her get some leftovers. She needs to have some breakfast. Knox says, congrats on landing that sweet job. I think it's going to be great for you. Knox, do you even know who I am? Do you even know who I am, Knox? Oh yeah, we're friends, okay, I guess. Jenny Charm, wow. Okay. Once Dina... Oh, she's awake. Make an excellent drink and become inspired. Sure will. Let's go ahead and have Dina um, make a drink. Make her favorite drink because she made it excellent last time. So this will be an easy one to complete. And then we'll have her go to the bathroom when she's done. This lady is clean all the way. She's, she can get out of the bathtub. She don't need to be in there no more. Get out of the ba thy bathtub. Get out. She literally moaned at me. That was weird. All right. Use. Take a bath. Oh, she wants to adopt a child. All right. Get some leftovers. Dina just wants all the stuff that I personally want. She wanted a dog, too. Yeah. I remember these things, okay? I remember these things. She wants a child. And a dog. And I'm so for it. Barfing. <laughs> she's really nauseated. So she's going to get sick. I, I canceled out of her going to work. Because. Um, I want her to do. I want her to take a day off. Because she's not feeling very great. And I kind of want them to adopt. Or I kind of want her to be here for the babies aging up. So that's what we're going to do. Aw, thanks. And Tina's phone is ringing. Tina, it says, say what? When answering a question, Wolfgang used forbidden words. It really shocked the teacher. i am be honest with you. Tina would not care. She does not know Wolfgang like that. But Gunther might. So... I don't know. I feel like Tina would just say, they're just words. All right. He seems to be a little bit less insensitive. Okay, if you say so. Alright, Gunther, you're done. Okay, we're gonna actually age up the baby. Dina, you're the one slowing us down. Seriously, girlfriend. Alright, no food. Your hygiene's full. Let's go. Alright, go here. I'm gonna have... I'm gonna unlock this door. Because now everybody can come in. I'm going to have you come in here, and Gunther, I'm going to have you come in here. Um, his mom is calling again. Quick question. <laughs> Kila, I don't even know how to say this name. Hawapalai. <laughs> it's, it's a Hawaiian last name, okay? I'm not, I'm not Hawaiian. And I were planning to spend some casual friend time together. Should I do it? To be honest, I'm not sure, because I don't know who this person... I don't... <sighs> some casual friend time together. Alright, if it's just friends, I mean, go for it. Alright, let's go. Come on. Gunther, hello? Are you coming? Alright, here he comes. No, Tina. Get away from the board. 
All right. Let's go ahead and age him up. Oh my gosh, there was two of him. All right, Gina's like, deuce, I don't care about this. <laughs> Couldn't even keep her in the room for the baby to age up. All right, so he's now a toddler. And we're going to randomize traits. So he got inquisitive and independent. Independent. Wow, look at me killing it. All right. Why does he look massive? Does he not look huge? Oh. Holy moly. Oh my god, look at him. Narshkul Fabachi. Oh, yibs. I don't know. I can't tell. He kind of looks huge to me, but it might be because I'm used to the Sims 2 toddlers and they're like, they are very small. All right, this is what he looks like. Terrifying. His eyes are a swirl. What is that? What? No, you're supposed to let me win. What? Cheater. <laughs> He's playing like a racing game. He's playing Forza or whatever. Forza, I think. Um. And I was like, my AI was like racing. It was cool, okay? Um, let's see. <laughs> we need to change Carl's looks. Um, probably won't delete the baby crib just yet. Because she wants to adopt a child. She doesn't want to have a baby, but she wants to adopt a baby. That kind of makes sense. Some people are just like really against having children, like physically caring and giving birth to babies. But she doesn't want to adopt a baby. I don't know. What does he feel about? He would be happy to have one. So maybe it's him kind of pressuring her into it. I don't know. We'd have to wait and see. Anyways, um, Carl has aged up. So now. I need to edit him, but I need to edit him technically in cast. And I don't have a whole ton of time left on the stream. But we'll modify Carl for Sherzies and change his last name Mom, to no. Munch. Mom, Munch. <laughs> um, eventually, I'm not going to allow babies to be randomly named. Um eventually we'll be going A through Z, but I don't know right now because I don't actually have like a, like all the names written out quite yet. So this is going to be just fine. Oh my goodness, child. What happened to your head? <laughs> um, okay. Let's go ahead and pick a hairstyle. I kind of like that hairstyle, but, like, what is on the floor? What is that? Why is... What is that? I kind of like this, actually. That's really nice. Okay. We'll go with that. And then he obviously likes the color red. And... Oh, my God. That just gave me a freaking heart attack. I almost just jumped out of my chair. Um... All right, that's that's a good outfit. And then he needs a red outfit for this. And this is like the only red outfit I think that there is in the game for children or toddlers, I mean, for a formal. And then he needs a red um, sleepwear. And I really honestly love these. I think they are adorable. But there isn't a red one. There's a red one of these, though, but it's, like, Christmas. And we're not really in Christmas, so... <sighs> it doesn't work. There's this, but I don't think that fits his style. So... Let's go with that. Let's go with my ants. And then we'll do the slippers. Oh, my God, he has a do-rag on. 
That's a no. <laughs> um, not his style. Party attire. What is he, a clown? I guess so. He's a clown. Clown upside. Oh my god, the do rag though. I don't even. I don't even think it looks nice. It's not even a cute one. Um, swimming attire. I like this a lot. I don't even know where we got that from. But I like it. Okay, I'm gonna go with that. Hot attire. I really love these, even in The Sims 2. This is, this is my go-to for babies. But there isn't a red one again. What's wrong with this game? Okay. And we'll give him those, because those are cute on kids anyways um let's see i barely ever use separates what's wrong with me does this have a backpack on it hold up oh my freaking goodness i have never seen this a day in my life but like the backpack is just yes is my answer to that so <laughs> I wish there was a red one because I would totally use it. The next time I find a baby that ha can use one of those, I am going for it. All right. Um. I mean, really though. <laughs> That's cute, but like the backpack being green sucks. Ugh. All right, I don't know. I'm gonna have to go with something else, I think. Let's go with that. With the black pants. And the red boots. And I wanna give him a hat. Uh, give him this hat. No. Give him this. Cute. So cute. Okay. There is Carl Munch. This last name is just too much. Munchin. Okay. <laughs> Let's leave there. I have three Manutos. So what are we going to do in our three minutes? We can get Carl a bed. Because he doesn't have one. And I think that would be it. Um, wh why do these keep changing? Does anyone else have this issue when they go in and out of things that it keeps changing? Because now she wants to be a freelance artist and I'm not doing it. Carl, I need you to change into your disguise. We might live in a time where people are okay with us looking like aliens. But we also need to be careful. You're a child in a world where science is a big thing. And we don't want them to come steal you for science experiments. So disguise yourself, boy. Comfort. Kids, I mean. We need a bed for this baby. Okay. That is not a toddler bed. That's that that that, that wasn't it. Um, the orange one is plenty okay. What? Did I not put that in there? I swear I put that in there. I guess I didn't. Alright. Well, he likes red though. So actually... Hmm. Is there a red version of this? There isn't. Alright, hold on. I have to look because I'm very curious and curiosity kills the cat. I know. But I'm a curious cat, so... I need to, I need to know if I can change this whole room. Really, bro? You have three windows and this kid has none? Come on. Those are donks. Give the child one window at least. Alright, um, so it's a dark brown now, which is fine. Just... Can I change this color? 
Oh, no, I can't. Okay. <laughs> Please forgive me as I delete everything in the room. Um, I don't think I can change this color either. So let's just do this. I want to... Oh my goodness. I've literally deleted this whole room. I might as well have just started anew. Because seriously, it's just I just deleted it all. Not even worth it to try and keep it at this rate. Red. Okay, let's find him a carpet real quick under decorations. Oh, maybe we could find a red frog or something. No? Okay. What about this? Is there a red... There's a red version of this. Let's just make it like one bigger. Bam. Awesome. Okay. And then what else is in here? There was a toy box. And is there anything else? There was that kid thing. But like who, what if he doesn't even want that? Oh, he needs a potty. Yeah, let's do that in his room. And we can get him a red high chair. But I don't really know if we're going to use that. We'll just, we'll just put it in the kitchen. In the dining Or in the kitchen. Um... Oh, there was a teddy bear thingy thing thing. Is there a red one? Is this red? Ha ha! That is devilish looking. That's scary. Uh, we could do these in red. And then what else is in here? Oh, a toy box. That's right. We need a red toy box. Is there a red toy box in here? Ready. Ready, mixed teddy. Okay. And then, I think that's it. Well, we need a slide. Toddler toys. Slide. We'll just do the black one because, like, I don't, um, I don't know what else to do. Uh, can we get rid of this big bush that does nothing? Because, pointless. And let's flip that around. Just because I, 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 I imagine that you wouldn't want your kid sliding onto, like, hard bricks. You know? Um, I think that's it. What are you listening for? Oh, I heard summer. Oh, you heard summer? Oh, I heard. oh no. Light, lighting. Let's see. Is it because of the storm or because I'm being loud? Oh, poor baby. She'll be alright. <sighs> she normally, if she whines, she normally goes right back to sleep. So she should be fine. Okay, I think that's it. Um, I'm gonna also change Wolfgang's bed. Oh, I can't. Shoot. Okay, deleting. Um, I want him to have a black bed. Let's see. I really like this. Honestly, I'm, I'm not lying to you guys. I really like this. That they added that. It's really cool. It would work really well in a small, like, little home for a family that um, had, like, a child. And also was, like, parents. Like, a set of parents. It would really work. It would work well. Okay, so now her room is so empty. Oh, I don't know what I'm going to put in there for her, but right at this moment, nothing. Okay, so we've made his room. He is star VC mode. So let's, let's get him some food. Put Carl here, please. Yeah. And thank you. Yeah. Put Carl in the high chair. I just want to make sure we get his needs taken care of before we get off. Hello? <laughs> okay. Are you seriously just going to not put Carl here? Okay, and then he wants to search for vampire information and level up in the video gaming skill. So, let's see. Play game. Play Sims forever. Play Blick Block. He's like a smart sim. He wouldn't do anything else. Flirt with someone. And what's this? Visit the pool. Um, Wolfgang. 
All right, Wolfgang needs to work on Luna. Send her a text and chat with her. He wants to go on a dream date. Oh, now he wants to make a prank call, but I already know he wants to go on a dream date, so. Yes, thank you. Larkin, Moosh, Yebu, Ponka, Bazi. Listen here, my child. We might be aliens, but you must eat thy yogurt of the humans. Wow, they left the stem on the strawberries and gave it to the kid. And they didn't even cut the strawberry in half or anything. Oh, it's gone. Whoa, okay. <laughs> He's talking about ducks. All right, anyways. All right, well, that's where I'm going to leave it for this stream because I think we've done quite a bit. We've gotten through just about a day and a half, and that's pretty good. Um, we did the scenario as well, which wasn't really big because nothing really happened, but that's all right. And, yeah. So, if you guys enjoyed this, please don't forget to check out my YouTube channel because that's where I post these videos and all my other videos. Um, and... I will talk to you guys in my next stream. Later.